But anyway, walking, walking down the, walking down to the studio. You can tell I haven't slept. I'm incapable of decent speech. <laughs> walking down to the station, trying to think, racking my brain, trying to think of a video, and I finally remember. Newman Nightlife. Newman's Nightlife is. Uh, it, it takes me back again to the previous video about Newman being basically Australia's nightmare. It's just these incredibly unusual things happen and you just kind of forget about them. I have loads of stories of just unusual nighttime experiences. Mainly because at one point I just like waking up at 3am and going like really just walking really early in the morning. Weird time in my life. But it happened. I remember one time I was walking to work like 3am, going down, walking, and just past this one house, and it, it's right near where I, kind of just close enough to my house that's just weird that this happened, but still far enough away to be worried, is I walked past the house, and then this dog just came barreling towards me and barking at my face, completely unchained. I was just frozen in fear, just like friggin' Oh, what's a what's a good analogy? I was basically had the frozen status in Pokemon Pearl, just cut, just an ice ice sculpture, just frozen in this position, and this dog would just growl at me, and I was just like, <gasps> and I just slowly backed away and kept walking to work like an absolute trooper. But fuck, did that make me wake up in the morning? There, there is no better wake up. For all you caffeine addicts out there, I know you exist, Newman. Don't ask me why I know. I just implicitly know. <laughs> Coffee ain't got nothing on getting terrorized by a dog. Okay? It wasn't one of the East Newman special stray dogs. No, it was a proper dog. Ugh. <laughs> Waking me up just thinking about it. I ain't getting to sleep at all today now. At that period of time, like a couple hours after the pub shuts, but like also a couple hours before all the day shifters start their work at five. So you got that little period of like between two and four, and it's just the weirdest things happen because no one's up. But you know, sometimes when you're walking at that time, you just you see your best mate just sleeping on one of the parking spot shade sails, just chilling sleeping on top of there for some reason. Just, you see that sometimes, and you kind of wonder if they were actually real, or just figments of your imagination, given how early it was in the morning, you might still have been in your half in your little dreams. There's a very beautiful silence to the Newman night time. The, the very, very late, or I suppose early, depending on your perspective, Newman night. It's very peaceful. Unless someone is having a friggin' party that's still somehow going on 3M, in which case you just always hear distant midnight oil and um, cold chisel songs in the background. Which, I'm not complaining, they're great songs. But like, just pour, just, it's 3am, why are you still up partying? I was once up from 5 after the bloody slow. It doesn't get better after 12, man. Just go. The after suck ass. Uh, that's not the only time that dog disturbed me. I do remember one another time I was going to an undisclosed working location at 3am. And I was just walking, right? And this just dog. I saw that dog again, right? It wasn't chasing me this time, but it was following me. I just saw it running. Not necessarily towards me, but kind of uh, parallel, just in the like little bush parts near the footpath. I just saw it peek in and out while I was like moving along, like a pretty little snake. It was very weird. I don't know what it was doing, just roaming around Newman at 3am, given it was definitely owned by a set of owners. I can't remember if it even had a collar on. It was just this massive. Dog, I can't remember the breed, just running around East Newman. It's so funky. 
I'm going to leave it there. Make sure to like and subscribe the video because if you want more videos like this, you have to like and subscribe. Do you understand? I'm sick and tired of my posting channel having more subscribers. Nearly double the subscribers of my main channel. I need actual people who are like, yeah, I'm going to guarantee this person is going to have a viewer base in the future kind of thing. That would be kind of neat. Thanks. Yeah.